A former Bemidji school teacher has been charged with three counts of sexual misconduct involving children. John Thorne Wangberg was charged with two counts of sexual degree criminal sexual conduct and one count of fifth degree criminal sexual conduct. Lacey Montelio joins us live in the studio with more on the charges against Wangberg. Lacey, what can you tell us? Well, Jamil Wangberg served as a physical education teacher at Central Elementary for many years before the first accusation was brought against him in March 2011. Police say it took so long to bring charges against Wangberg because of the complexity of this specific case. It's been nearly two years since the first accusations of child abuse were brought against former Central Elementary physical education teacher John Wangberg. There have been accusations in the past, but none that we could substantiate enough to uh, rise to the level of criminal charges. According to the criminal complaint, a student went to Wangberg for a tissue and Wangberg held her upside down and touched her when her pants fell down. The complaint says that Wangberg said in an interview that he had picked up the girl but he had not touched her. Two other children are identified in the criminal complaint as having been inappropriately touched by Wangberg. Maston says it took a while to gather evidence. It wasn't until the victim came forward in mid-November that we were able to start substantiating evidence that would uh, support criminal charges. He says these types of cases can be difficult. There's a lot of extra time and care that goes into it because of the age of the victims and the need to get the most accurate statements and the most accurate evidence. There's computer forensics that are involved, there's uh, medical interviews and examinations that have to take place. This particular case has presented even more challenges. So there are children that have lived in our community that have since moved away but now we're reporting this to us. For now, Maston says the outcome is really in the hands of the court, but the investigation is ongoing. I'm anticipating that once this becomes um, knowledge within the public and there's information spread about this particular investigation, that there may be more people that come forward now, Bemidji School Superintendent James Hess told us earlier today that Wangberg was placed on administrative leave as soon as the first accusation was made, and he no longer works for the school district. Wangberg did appear in court today. We did attempt to contact Wangberg for comment, but we were told that he was not available. Jamil. Thanks so much, Lacey, and we'll have more on this developing story tomorrow. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.